Roaming form Gimme Ghoul has finally made its way into Pokemon Go. Hey yo, what's up beautiful people? It's your boy Mitch Mortar. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you, yes you, how to get Roaming form Gimme Ghoul in Pokemon Go. So let's get started. Alright, so first step is we're going to open up the X menu in Scarlet or Violet, and then we're going to go to Poke Portal, and then we're going to go all the way down to Mystery Gift, and then Connect to Pokemon Go. Now next you're going to select Pair with the Pokemon Go account, and then hit. Now as it's searching, you're going to want to go over to your phone. Next in your Pokemon Go app, you're going to want to click on the Pokeball, go to Settings, Scroll to where it says Connected Devices, click Connect to Nintendo Switch. Now back on the Switch, it says an account has been found for Mitch Mortar, so that's my Pokemon Go name. Would you like to pair with this account? Hit Yes. Now we pair with the account. Now turn right connecting to Pokemon Go. Now we'll select Connect to Pokemon Go. Now back on your phone, you want to go to your item bag here. Go to your postcards and select literally any postcard. I'm going to do this one, Izzy's. This is a Nice little like taco slash ice cream place uh, that me and my wife went to when we went to Florida. Goodbye. So now it is going to be connecting to my Switch. Postcard sent. Okay. So now back at the Switch, we have the mystery gift. Now this gives you. Now this unlocks Vivian with. An unusual pattern, and then you get 50 Gibbyul coins and five Pokeballs. Now, as you can see, whenever we connected Pokemon Go to our Switch, we unlocked an item in Pokemon Go called the Coin Bag. So, what this is is pretty much just like the Meltan like mystery box thing, and it's just going to spawn Gimme Ghoul for 30 minutes. Now, I'm not too sure how often it spawns, but we'll just wait here until we find one. Okay, so we found a Gimme Ghoul, and it took probably about like 30 seconds for the first one to spawn. So, we're just going to catch it real quick. And we caught it. Now, I don't know if this is, like, a bug in the game, but he's, like, super tiny. I mean, he's... Gibby Ghoul is really tiny, like, in Scarlet and Violet, so I don't know if this is, like, like intentional or not. But literally, like, this one is... It says extra large, so I would hate to see what, like, an extra small one is. Now, also, as you can see here, um, it, to evolve Gimme Ghoul into Goldango, you need 999 Gimme Ghoul coins. Uh, kind of just, like, in the game. So, um, whenever we caught this first Gimme Ghoul... It subtracted that, so we only need 998 more. So I'm assuming that uh, whenever you catch Gimme Ghoul, that number goes down. Now, I don't know if that means you need to catch 999 Gimme Ghoul, or if, like in the game, whenever you encounter Gimme Ghoul, it gives you a random number of coins. Now, I'm assuming with the next home update, whenever you can connect Scarlet and Violet, that you'll be able to transfer your roaming form Gimme Ghoul to Scarlet and Violet. But there you go, that's how you get roaming form Gimme Ghoul in Pokemon Go. If you enjoyed this video or found it helpful, please consider giving it a like. It'll help appease the almighty YouTube algorithm and it'll help this video reach more viewers. Also, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. It'll really mean a lot and it'll really help me out. Farewell for now, my friends. See you in the next video. Peace. All right, so first step is you're going... Pop it. Get out of here. <laughs> what is happening? Oh, my God.